9 raised to power x minus 3 raised to power s is equal to 6. Hi everyone, welcome to my class. In this class, we want to find the value of s from this given nice equation. 9 raised to power x minus 3 raised to power s is equal to 6. But before we proceed, please don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Thank you. Solution. We have the given equation 9 raised to power s minus 3 raised to power s is equal to 6. Now, 9 raised to power s is the same thing as 3 squared raised to power s minus 3 raised to power s is equal to 6. Now, remember that if you have a raised to power n raised to power m, the same thing as a raised to power m raised to power n then this become t raised to power s square minus t raised to power s is equal to 6 this is t raised to power s and we have t raised to power s here let y is equal to t raised to power s now half y square minus y is equal to 6 y square minus y minus 6 is equal to 0 this is a quadratic equation which can be solved by using either quadratic general formula or factorization method but in this case we're going to make use of factorization method now we have y square minus 3y plus 2y minus 6 is equal to 0. Now let's factor y out here. We have y into y minus 3 plus 2 into y minus 3 is equal to 0. Now, this is y minus 3 and y minus 3. Here is y and plus 2. Now, we have y plus 2 into y minus 3 is equal to 0. There are two cases here that y plus 2 equal to 0 or y minus 3 is equal to 0. Now, from here y is equal to minus 2 that is one of the value of y let's call that y1 also from here y is equal to 3 this is the second value of y let's call this y2 but recall that 3 raised to the power s is equal to y now 3 raised to the power s is equal to minus 2 or 3 raised to the power s is equal to 3. Now from here, 3 raised to the power s is equal to minus 2. Then since 3 raised to the power s cannot take the negative, then we conclude that cannot take the negative, then we reject this And work with this 3 raised to power s is equal to 3. Now remember that 3 is the same thing as 3 raised to power 1. Now we have 3 raised to power s is equal to 3 raised to power 1. They have the same base s is equal to 1. That is the true value of x. Now we can check to confirm if our answer is right or wrong. Let's check. We have the given equation 9 raised to power s minus 3 raised to power s is equal to 6. Now at s is equal to 1, we have 9 raised to power 1 minus 3 raised to power 1. Let's see, must be equal to 6. Now this is. 9 raised to the power 1 is 9, minus 3 raised to the power 1, that is 3. 
must be equal to 6. Now, 9 minus 3, this is 6, is equal to what? 6, which satisfies the given equation at S is equal to 1. So, if you have enjoyed the class, please don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Thank you.